Hello, I am Mal, and welcome back to Master of Orion Conquer the Stars, our Let's Play as... The Silicoids. Now, let's see, where were we? Okay, that's looking pretty good. Oh, right, we're already building troop transports. Mm-hmm. Oh, I think that means that, uh... They're like these poor guys. Yeah, the Darlocks find themselves between a rock and a hard case. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it's bad. So bad. Okay, let's see. What can we do? What can we do? Sending all the destroyers here? Question mark? Why? Oh, because I was going to take this system next, I think? Yeah. Concordia. Do we have another colony ship being built? Not at the moment. Okay, our buddies, the Terrans, are meh with the Darlaks. We're okay here. We actually have treaties with everyone right now? Yeah, we do. Okay, that's pretty funny. I forgot about that. Hmm, you keep doing pollution cleanup, that's fine. And now, oh, the news. The state of the galaxy. And now, the state of the galaxy. Current ranking of space fleet strength. That's right. That's right. <laughs> okay. What do we got over here? 2895. Okay. Do I want to do these upgrades? It certainly looks like I do. How much money do we have? Um, enough. Okay, go ahead and do these upgrades then. 64 slash 200. All right. With each new discovery, the knowledge of the crag grows, Keystone. So I'm going to test this out according to some uh, comments. Uh, if we put hydroponic farms on these planets, the plus two food growth, like as an example right here, would actually improve the growth rate, which it shouldn't, and I hope they change, but I want to experiment with that. Like, I get I get different techs, like uh, microbiotics or something like that, that specifically reduces your need for food, therefore fuels growth. That I get, but actual, like, farming? Why would that help somebody that doesn't eat any of the food? That's, I mean, that, that can't be working as intended. It just can't be. I'm saying it can't be working as intended. That's what I'm saying. Portal Shipyard. Uh, maybe we should beeline it for a higher level tech, like I did my other LP. Yeah. Um, wouldn't mind having Inferno Transformation. Okay, let's do this. Let's grab this. Actually, let's grab this first, because I want to do this experiment. So, Microbiotics and Cloning Center as well. Yeah, I want to see how this stacks out. Let's do that. fighting they're fighting exactly what we want to see Here at max pop, I can't even do the experiment here. 
Though no sense putting any food stuff there. All right, fine. Build the neutron collider then. A segment of your attention. Can I go after them next? I th I think so, yeah. All right, let's rally here then. Need a colony ship for here. What do you got for us, Miner Civ? Okay, yeah, I guess we can accept that quest. They're greedy, though, aren't they? Seems like they are. Next population in two turns, huh? Okay, let's grab a hydroponic here. I just want to see what effect this has, if anything. I bring a deal to strengthen the bonds of our fellowship. Uh, really want to give you tech for 60 credits, but that's yeah, fine. You can have it. I don't think that made any difference at all. The hydroponic? We'll see what happens with the other tech, like the cloning center and stuff, but... It doesn't seem like it's doing anything, and it shouldn't. Okay, now... Let's go get... A kink requires your attention. Oh, I can't take them both right, it's one or the other. Okay, well... We'll go for the 15% with the no cost associated with it then. Exquisite. Max pop. Okay, then 
Let's do civil transport. This only gets us to here, giving them a major tech. I don't know that the minor civ. I don't know that I really like the minor civ thing. But then again, I think I mentioned before, I'm not really big on that mechanic. And even in games like Civ Five, I tend to play with like no, like basically no city states or very few city states. I don't know why. It's just just my thing, personal preference. I'm not saying it's bad. It just doesn't add much to the experiment for me. But keep the other. What? Back, or worse. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna acquiesce to your request, sir. Yeah. Yeah, I don't I don't think we'll be giving you a system. You lost your minds. You should have accepted our generous offer. Should have accepted, huh? Well, don't worry. I've got something coming for you here shortly. Let's see. All right. Waiting orders. Okay, let's assign colony. Send you off. Let's lower our taxes here. A segment of your attention. We can afford to, and this will get people off of the striking against us. Now we only got one striking. Oh, Galactic Council, all right. I will not take part in this travesty. See, what's the point of having really good, like, high-level relations with people if they won't vote for you, right? Am I gonna have to go threaten him? He should have voted for us. The Terrans should have voted for us. I choose myself to rule this council of galaxies. This one would bear this weight alone. Pretty close. That's cool. A segment of your attention. And then we'll build a cruiser here. Yeah, we've got the capacity to do that. Yeah, food stuff's not doing anything, and it shouldn't. Max pop. Max pop again? Really? Okay. Really need an advanced data center here. I just buy that? I can. Okay, let's do that then. And then we need another Civ transport. Mm-hmm. Did they make another adjustment? I need to go look at the news updates. Because why are the volcanic planets all of a sudden good at reducing pollution again? Something must have gotten adjusted. Yeah. Because with the phase 3 update, these weren't all that great anymore. 
I'll have to go look. I'll have to go look. Why don't you already know, Mal? Well, because it's, even though I play lots and lots of Master of Ryan, I don't read the thing non-stop now. Cut me a little slack. I try to keep up on it. As you well know. As you well know. And now, the news. A minor quake has struck a silicoid. Okay, what did it do? Destroy something? Answer to that was yes. With each new discovery, the knowledge of the crag... Okay, now... Let's go grab... Last three shields. A segment of your... Okay, acquire data there with the spy. Colonize. Do, 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 do. Treaties are done, huh? Okay, let's redo them. Hopefully. Welcome, friend. I listen and remember. Far into history back, we've been friended. Happy to. Okay, good. Bye bye now. Bye bye now. Welcome to the Hall of Cards. What do you propose? Gratefully accepted. What do you propose? I don't think so. Seriously? Why Some wouldn't you? things are not meant to be, I suppose. Why the Maybe heck wouldn't you, did. with long-term, strong diplomatic ties, why wouldn't they want that? That doesn't make any sense. We'll leave this open. We're going to go to war with them. Transport, you're going down here. Build another cruiser. Actually, I guess we should do pollution cleanup first. Actually, let's do advanced data center. Deep sea cooling. And then pollution cleanup. Let's do that in that order. And then we'll get back to building another cruiser. One nineteen attack or attack rating. Sixteen hundred and sixty-two defense rating. Pretty solid. Is it enough to go to war with them? Chart says yes. I don't really want to wait until we have this other tech to go.
Max pop again. Yeah, man, once the silicoids get going, they are just ridiculously strong. We have another world that's also, yeah, right here. Can't we upgrade you? Inferno transformation? Yeah, 700 production cost versus a Terran upgrade, which is 500. The Uber Planet upgrades are just, I don't know, we'll, we'll see. They weren't, um, they weren't as, they're not nearly as strong as they were post phase three update. So we'll just have to see whether or not it's worth it or not. But 39 turn investment, a lot. Okay, so let's see. What do we want here? Well, you don't really have any pop going into research yet, so you don't need that facility. Toxic processor? That's your pollution. Suppose you could. Do that and then work on another cruiser. And now. Eliminated the by the Terrans. Oh, wow. Genocide in the scars. The ruthless Terran Connate snuff out an independent planet before its people could reach the stars. Dead planet. Grief at 11. Distress mounts among the sentient races as the culture disappears quietly into the eternal night. The mighty are no more. My sensors registered a spike in electromagnetic emissions as their last ship was destroyed. I would hardly call that quiet. <laughs> okay. That's interesting. So they took out a minor race then. Alright, fair enough. Okay, or no transformation here as well, I guess. Okay, drop off that population. This is where it gets kind of crazy with the silicoid. So, you know, you get to the point where, you know, you got max pop somewhere and they're, you're cranking them out and then you can immediately pretty much turn it into a civil transport and then ship it somewhere else. Doesn't require any food, so you can just drop them off and the, you know, the colony just starts getting going quick. Yeah, they, they're probably the strongest uh, race right now, opening wise. Though I do like the clack on an awful lot. And then everybody's always saying that the the Cylons are super OP or whatever. I, I haven't even played them. Yeah, because I guess from the research perspective, they're like instant win button. I mean, I'll play them at some point. My plan is to pl play all of them, but uh, yeah, I haven't played them yet. Let's see. Cruiser. <laughs> at least I don't remember playing them. It's enough. I think this is enough. Let's let's go. Let's do this. This is GNN Galactic News. Oh, good. Network. They're at war with them, too. Perfect. It is a dog eat dog galaxy out there as the military might of the Sakra Brood battle against the Dalak Cabal for control of the galaxy. Love it. Yeah, we can take this for sure. All right, let's do it.
speed things along here. There we go. Goodbye. We have learned much of you from our... Need orders, huh? Okay, let's do... Let's see if we can, like, mess up your food. That would be kind of cool. Starbase, huh? Uh, I think we can take that. match speed break over to the right so it's still not you know a hundred percent there I don't think the tactical combat but it's much smoother at least for me in phase three some people are reporting that they're having um, harder times in phase three with um, the game in general in terms of like the, the load and what have you. I haven't had that problem, so I don't know. I mean, I obviously if people are, they are, but it seems to be running better for me. more to take this out than I thought it would. Here we go. It's gonna go down. Next salvo of missiles. There we go. A little bit of damage to the cruiser, but that's fine. Attack the colony. And it's ours. Nice. Or... Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. 83. Let's deal with that first, I guess. Wait, wait a minute. No f Oh, it's applying the no food requirement to these guys? What? Hold on. Let me double check something here real quick. Yeah, it, yeah, it is. Oh, that 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 shouldn't be the case. I hope they fix that. Yeah, these are subjugated workers. Why would they not have to eat? Yeah, hopefully they can do they can they can implement that. I hope that doesn't stay that way. Yeah. I wouldn't I wouldn't think so. Let's see. And then just put you on guard. All right, well, I think that's a good wrapping up point for this episode. So, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider hitting the thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching and until next time, I'm Mal and I will see you later.